right now, absolutely. Uh, but today we're going to be showing you a really cool technique of cutting a wine glass in half. We didn't, we don't even have one like staged to show you guys because this is going to be like a super fail. But it's probably going to work. Uh, we're going to cut this thing in half. You can fill it with candle stuff, and you know, just just let's let's get started. Well, thank you guys for tuning in. My name, as always, is Jason. Uh, yeah, really? Come on, guys. It's not that funny. And my lovely, beautiful assistant here tonight is... Izzy! That is right, folks. Her name is Izzy. She's off of school today. Stop clapping. Uh, those people, they're just animals. Uh, she's off of school today. Tell them why you're off of school today. I am off of school today because of... You're, you're thinking right now. It was teacher conferences. Teacher conferences, that's the word. But it's teacher only conferences. teacher conferences for kids that aren't doing so well. Luckily, we didn't have to go yeah. conference any teachers because this good. girl oh is God. straight A's. And uh, yeah, let us know what grades you make in the comment section below. Uh, a, B, C, D, or F? F, yeah. <laughs> I mean, and then let us know, you know, where you're, where you're from, all that good stuff. And then we're just going to get started with this lovely uh, technique. Yes. Do you, do you know anything about it? Um... No. Okay, so what we have here is a fancy little wine bottle that, you know, when someone drinks their wine, it's left with this. We're going to do, attempt to do, is cut it with an ordinary glass cutter like this. This little thing. This little thing. It's got a little tiny, if you can see that, it's a little bitty cutter. These are like $3. You can literally get, what's up, Official Gaming FFC? How you been, man? That's my Twitter friend. Oh, uh, nice. So you can get these pretty much anywhere, Ace... Harbor Freight, Hobby Lobby. It's oh not even God. sharp. Like, that's the coolest part about a, a glass cutter. Did you not feel that? Oh, no, I'm just kidding. So, yeah, it's like totally, uh, yep, a little late there. Late, guys. Applause sign. Do not even see the applause sign? So, it's not even sharp. It's really dull. But the idea of it is it's a really sharp-ish point that when it hits glass, you can hear it. I don't know if you can hear it. it we'll, we'll do one up here a little bit. It... Yeah, you can't really hear it. It just kind of crushes it, almost like a sandy-like crush. Yes. So good luck, thank you, oh, Jaden. We appreciate Scott that. Scott Kramer, glad you brought the the midget. Oh, thank After, you. Oh, here, is that better? This is my daughter Izzy. It wouldn't. It looked weird if she was this tall. I mean, yep. come on, there. Come on, let's. All right, we're gonna just do it normal. <laughs> she's like almost. She's like five I'm, foot. I'm, I'm average. A yeah, I am five, five foot. foot. I'm, average I'm just really tall. Height, average height. So what we're going to do here, we'll set up a top view real quick for you guys. So we're going to have a cup here. Not a cup. This is a, uh, a container of plastic. Sort of. Yes. Yes. We're going to put the wine glass in it, and we're going to pour hot water, then cold water, then hot water, and then hopefully it breaks. Because that's what we've seen what online. I've done a video like this for a year ago, uh, yeah. but it was, it was a, a stage. Not stage. It was a video that was edited. And yes. it worked. It really did work. So we're really excited to uh, bring it to you guys live on our what's Thursday night DIY. It's our new thing. Yes. Well, I love working with glass. Well, Killer Boo Boo 15, that is totally awesome because we love working with glass as well. Yes. Do you actually work work with glass? Like, tell us what you do with glass. We'd really totally love to know. Um, we should do another play we button. We should. We should do another play button. We yes. really want to do a play button so, for... Two so far, right? Two? Yes, we've done two so far. We really want to do one for Dan TDM. It's just, it's really hard to get to that guy. Uh, I've tried, yeah, you know, if you guys can help share it out and let us, you know, get his attention, we would love to uh, send him one. It's just really, he's far away. He's not in our country. So it kind of like, I'm scared to send something overseas. Yeah. It's like crazy. All right, so. Jaden Grego. Yes. Yes, we like popular memos. Can Absolutely. Let's give them a round of applause, guys. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, popular memos is one rocking channel. So is Gaming with Jen. Don't be embarrassed if you're a dude and you like Gaming with Jen. I like watching Gaming with Jen. <laughs> it's totally okay, and it's a lot of fun. Stop clapping. Gosh, these people are just excited tonight. Yes. Okay, so here was the original plan. I found this utensil holder that we had in our house. It's my wife's. It's a little dirty in there, but it's just been sitting in a, a closet. And what I was going to use is that to pretty much the idea is here. We're going to go back to normal view. Oh, that was that was super quick. Uh, and we need something to guide the, the cutter uh, across the wine bottle. We want a straight line when we cut this. But 
I found this plastic yes. little thing, yes. uh, which, you know, speaking of, I'm a woodworking channel. Uh, so they have these bench dogs, which you usually use these to paint on. So if you're setting up something, you would put these down on your table and you could paint on it. You use oh, a router on it. Cool. It keeps it from slipping on you really cool. And see, they fit really good inside of this. So throw oh. those out and we just use the plastic. Extreme oh, ex extinct. Extremely 20, extinct 23 uh, extreme. is from Houston. Houston. What? We used to live yes. north of Houston. Extreme... Lee Extinct 23. We were in Montgomery up in the Conroe area. We lived there for since Izzy, well, up to like six years six, ago. Yeah. So Houston is totally rad. My brother still lives in Houston. We'll be going out there for a wedding, his wedding, up in May. So we might, might run into him. Boo Boo 15 is from Alabama. What is up? And the UK. Holy oh, smokes. Official gaming is that, uh, yeah, official game. The UK. UK. Holy smokes. I would love to. And to, no, no Trump over in the UK. It's just really nice and quiet. Mm, relaxing. Peaceful. All right, so anyway, this, look at that. Oh, that was dusty. Look at this. It fits right in. It's going to give us a little guide, I hope. I'm looking at myself. Uh, it's going to okay. give us a little guide, uh, and we're going to try that out right now, right in front of you guys for the first time yes. ever in the world. So hopefully it'll pick it up. So here's the deal. You want the, uh, the glass cutter, just a normal old ordinary Ace Hardware glass cutter for like three bucks, not sponsored. Hey, look, we got someone from New Mexico. New Mexico. Holy smokes, you guys are all over wow. the planet. Uh, so we're going to basically, you only want to do it one time. You can't run this twice. So if you guys are doing this, definitely get a parent's help if you're like under, I don't know, how old? Is he? Under like, I don't know. Under 16. If you're 16, you're old enough. You yeah. know, do whatever you want to do. Alaska? Uh, oh, wow. Holy Alaska. smokes. That's far. I've never been there. Uh, okay, so we're going to basically go and cut this around like this, and it's going to give us a nice, hopefully, straight edge. Now, find that marker. Where's that marker? All right, so we want to mark it because we do not want to do this twice. If you go over it twice, you risk uh, it not working. Uh, so let's, you know, all right, we're going to try this. So I'm going to do it like this, guys. This obviously has not been cut before. This isn't a magic show or anything. I'm not going to show you guys magic, uh, but it might be. I'm going to use this as a guide. I'm not even going to look uh, do you have to press at hard? the camera. You want to press firmly. So if, we, if we're quiet, we might be able to hear it. Let's see if we hear it cutting. So I'm basically going to push this thing. They sell glass cutters that do this, and they're, like, expensive. So... And it's got an automatic little thing. You just spin the bottle. If you want to sell, a, you know, start a store on Etsy and do that, go ahead and buy that. But this is just for you're at home, you're bored. All right, here we go. We're gonna. All right, you hold, you do me a favor. Hold the base, and then just keep it from moving. So this might be a two man operation. We're gonna keep it pushed. Do you hear that? Oh yeah. I hear and we drew a little marker on there to let us know where we started, and then that way we do not go too far and do double cuts oh it sounds so good it's like sand and glass because if you're a minecraft fan you know that sand it's is uh becomes glass now we have a nice little cut oh that's actually pretty good holy smokes Wow. well look at that guys okay so we have our cut I, i'm like actually really excited we can just end the show here we made a straight cut we're good game over done, done. But Part we're going to keep going. Part. We're going to nope. cut this thing yes. in two. So, yeah. Yes. Well, I think we should just try it. Yes. We're going to bring our stuff here. Mm -hmm. Set it back up on the uh, top view. All right. So, this bucket is to catch water. What we're going to do is we're going to set this here. Izzy, speaking of safety, always wear safety gear. Izzy will be wearing a helmet. Helmet. Also known as a, you never know, this glass could blow up. I have no idea. Yeah, I didn't do much research on it, so <laughs> you never know. She's got some welding gloves that'll keep in case the glass breaks. So we're gonna fit those on. That's your uh, oh goodness, what ha your your hands oh. are all backwards. <laughs> we're gonna put your other one on. This is just in case. This is definitely overkill, but you know what? <laughs> it just makes look Izzy look so cool. Look at this. Wave to everybody, Izzy. Look at that welding, Izzy. She's ready to rock it out the park. Just don't weld in this because that will not protect your eyeballs. We have cold water. Uh, luckily, we live in Chicago. Uh, obviously, you guys are from like Pennsylvania. I did see there. Uh, yeah, we've got a lot of snow, so this is just tap water. We filled it with snow, so it's got a nice little condensation on there. If you could see that. Oh, and this is Star of Rock, Illinois. Not sponsored, but this place is amazing. It's got these all these canyons and waterfalls and just natural oh, amazingness. Paul said, "Cut it with the welder." Cut it with the welder. <laughs> that Paul, Mr. Paul, I, you're probably right. 
And that's another episode. Uh, it's going to be called the Squatty Potty Welder episode. Uh, Mr. Paul Peck, he, uh, he does drywall. Really rad guy. He uh, actually thinks... You ever seen the Squatty Potty commercial? No. Well, it's a, it's a unicorn and it poops and it brings your legs up. Never mind. It's something for older people. But well, we're going to make a live DIY Squatty Potty. That'll probably be next week there, Paul. But we're going to do it. We need to fly you in from Florida and come hang out and yes. do that. I've got hot water and a Sub-Zero. We're going to find out how good Sub-Zero makes these vacuum hot cold things because I put hot boiling water in this about 20 minutes ago by the time I set up this dang OBS. Uh, so it's probably just warm water. But just in case... We are prepared to heat it up and just make things work. You know what I'm saying? So the idea is hot water shocking the glass. Cold water is going to shock the glass from hot. Putting, pouring it right on. We're going to go out of top view here. And it's going to, you know, do that. And it's going to cut it. We're going to pour it right over that. It's going to be amazing. You know, it's going gonna, it's gonna to deserve a round of applause. Absolutely. I mean, thank you guys. We, have a do, we do have a live studio audience in case you're just joining us. And, you know, they're very rambunctious. Uh, okay, Izzy, so what we're going to do is I'm going to pour the hot water in first. Mm -hmm. And I'm going to hold the glass. Holy, that just bubbled over. Uh, look at that steam, guys. I don't know if you're catching the steam. Look at the steam. Look steam. at that. All right, so I'm going to hold this here. Yeah. I'm going to pour the hot water over the crack. Mm -hmm. And then you're going to pour the cold water over the crack while I'm spinning the bottle. And hopefully, if science works, it's going to just fall apart. Worst case is it shatters in a million pieces and it'll look like an episode of Die Hard and it's just going to be really bad. Do you got that, sweetie? All right, she's opening the cold water. All right, we're ready. All right, so I'm going to pour. Oh, goodness, this is going to be awkward. Uh, we're going to pour some hot water. We're doing it now. We're doing it now. Hold on one second. All right, we got the hot water over the crack. You never hear that often. Now, cold water over the crack. Over the crack. And when it pops, you hear a kink, usually. Last time we did this, when we did the actual... For real edited version. Okay, that's enough cold. Now we're going to shock it hopefully again with hot. I'm not hearing a kink. So let's try the cold again. Hurry up, hurry, hurry, hurry. You only got a few seconds. Uh oh, this could be a fail, Izzy. That's not going to be good. Don't run out. Are you running out of cold water? Wait, no. No. No, I don't think so. I'm thinking the hot water is not hot enough. All right, cold, 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 cold. We might have to get more, uh... Oh, dear goodness. Come on, I'm please not, work. Can't I'm this not. work? Oh, 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 I think come I'm on. Out. I'm out. I'm out. Wait, oh, I just got... Snow. We might need to go get some more snow water here. Oh, it's just snow now. Can we pop it a little? Right. It's, just, it's just snow. It's just Look snow. at that, guys. Some Chicago Wait. snow here. Oh, there, yeah, there it is. <laughs> oh, no. It's not working. Okay, so what I'm going to do is we have a plan B. Oh, uh, I feel it so it. good. They, uh, yeah, I know tapping does work, but I was trying to keep it legit. I have seen the tapping. Yeah, you keep that mask on, girl. God, it is so close. I feel the... Uh... Oh, it's too much tapping. Uh, oh, man. It is like, seriously, listen to that. It's like two different levels. It's hard to see. Uh, it, gosh, it's so close. All right, we could I, we could totally heat up the water, but man, I know it's about to snap. I just want it to be clean because we actually have a plan on using this for a. Uh... We know it is like really close to popping, so we're gonna just let this. I just warm water. We're gonna sit it here. <clears throat> All right, do me a favor. You go run. All right, so we're in the shop right now, and we are gonna do this. I'm gonna heat up the water. So just stick around. It's totally gonna be rad. Uh, she's gonna go get some cold water. Don't worry, there's still a little snow in it, so just get so cold, just water. cold water. Maybe a little snow. Uh, and I'm gonna snow? start boiling some water. Okay, cold water. Cold water. Izzy's gonna get the cold water. So I'm gonna serenade you guys with a, uh, a torch and heating some water. That's probably really loud. So we're gonna, we're gonna, we'll keep it over there. Uh, and while, while we're uh, watching, you know, just we'll have some conversations in the chat, you know, keep it real, just have a lot of fun. I was hoping this wouldn't have to happen, but you know what? It did, and it's just gonna, it's gonna, it's gonna just drive the views. It's gonna drive the ratings. Uh, hours and hours of watch time. We'll be done about 2 a.m. Uh, Florida time. So Paul Peck, keep your britches on. It's gonna be totally awesome. Uh, lucky you with snow just right outside the door. Oh yeah, so lucky, so lucky, Paul. Not everybody lives in Florida and can just enjoy that uh, warm summer winter that you guys have right now. But you know, it's totally good. 
A dude. Well, if you have a dude. I'm thinking you meant dud, killer, boo-boo, 15. We'll just say dud. D-U-D. But yeah, I, I like killer dude better. It sounds cooler. And stuff. <laughs> oh, Izzy is back. You put some snow up in that girl? Oh, that's alright. I'm gonna get this hot so it shouldn't even matter. Snow is too cold there, guys. Did you guys know snow is too cold, according to Izzy? Alright, put your gear back on. No, you have to, just in case. This is danger. This could be danger. Okay, so while my dad is doing that, I have a joke for you. Oh, well, well I don't even have to do this. We can just so, hear the joke. Okay, so, I don't want to mess it up. What is your joke? So, you know um, the dog? Uh -huh. It's called a Shih Tzu. Right, yeah. Those are really pretty dogs. Okay. What, um, what do you call a zoo that has one dog in it? Uh, what I... I no oh, goodness, oh, Grammy! No. That was horrible. Izzy, stop it! No, <laughs> do not, don't unhear that. That was really bad. Hey, you're too young to be telling oh, jokes like that. Sorry. It was funny though. That was actually a really good joke. Where'd you hear that at? Someone. Oh goodness! If you get what what the answer was, just put it in the comments below. Oh. We uh, we'd love to hear what you thought the actual answer of that joke was. Bell. Put your hat on now, Mister. Just like her dad. Yes. <laughs> yeah, she's a she is a she's a funny one right there. Good. She's only 11. Come on. 11 year olds don't know what that word is. All right, we are boiling up here. I'm gonna have to put top view on here. You left the door open. Now you're gonna hear like noise and stuff. All right, check that out, guys. So we are boiling water the old school way with a torch uh, of map gas, because that's pretty much how they used to do it in the olden days when you wanted uh, some soup. So look at that, we are boiling. We are gonna be hot. Uh, and by the way, Sub Zero, the people who made that coffee thermal mug thing, is not legit because the water was boiling 10 minutes ago, wasn't even close to hot. So sorry if this is really loud, guys. Uh, oh, thank Jaden got it. All right, Jaden, high five there, buddy. High five. Thumbs up for sure. Welding thumbs below up. All right, we are boiling. Look at that, guys. We are boiling water live on YouTube. I don't know how many times you guys have watched Boiling Water on YouTube, but seriously, this has probably got to be the best ever, right? Like boiling Water. We're going to have a 24-hour channel we're opening up called Boiling Water. Uh, we're just going to boil water for 24 hours a day. Occasionally, we'll fill it up because what happens is it evaporates. And uh, we're going to get a lot of watch time. It's going to be a lot of fun, too. We hope you guys all join in on it. Hey, I don't know. I don't even know. Oh, you need no, let's go. All right, we are boiling, Izzy. Are you ready? Yes. We're going to do it, guys. We're cutting, in case you're just joining us, and Izzy is, we're cutting a gla a wine bottle in half with boiling water yes. and cold water. All right, okay. Izzy, hold on. Let me do the hot water first. Okay, Here we go, guys. Hopefully we hear a little snap. Uh, All right, cold water. Cold water. Hopefully it's cold. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Keep going. Uh-oh. All right, stop. And back to hot water. It's only supposed to take, oh, oh, here it goes, guys. Oh. I heard it snap. Oh, oh! smokes it. It was it was pretty good. All right, yeah. this is hot hot water here. Okay, guys. Yeah, we did it. We were super yeah. excited. Uh, due to the the nature of this not you know happening super quick, it's a somewhat clean cut. <laughs> we're gonna call that a somewhat clean cut. Half of our cut did was clean, yes. but I'm gonna be honest, and half of it was not. You can see the cut right there, and I'm thinking that was because we waited so long. Yes. Uh, for okay. the experiment, but is it hot? It's not, no, but it, it could be sharp. So now you have two options after your glass breaks. You could throw it away in the garbage, or you can have you can make nice some stuff. Candle. You can fill this. All right. Well, first thing you want to do is uh, just in case you get a really bad cut like this. This is really bad. Yes. Uh, oh wait, you know what? Hold on, hold on. I think it's gonna keep going. Oh, tap it. You gotta tap it. Now you're just like, what if you like break it in half or something? Well, then we. Well, gosh darn it. Okay, well, either way. So, it does happen clean. It might take one or two tries, but seriously, find a lady that drinks a lot of wine, you'll be happy. Uh, and take all of her wine bottles. It's recycling. I would take a, like a 150 grit sandpaper, roughly, and go over the edge of it uh, really well. You could also use it as a drinking cup, but definitely test out your edge. Like, this is super smooth. Like, we got a perfect cut here. It's not even sharp. 
I mean, oh, wow. I know it, it's, it's like it's a, it's, oh, it's, it's, I mean, it's glass, but yeah. you know, it, it won't cut you at all. Like literally, that will not cut. Oh, you. did you know from Nigel? It's Nigel. It's Nigel or Nigel plays twenty one. Did you know that Taylor Swift is from Pennsylvania? No, we I had no that. idea. Give it up to Taylor Swift. Absolutely. Thank you guys. Thank you crowd. Uh, Taylor Swift is a rad lady. So. Fill this up with your favorite like scents. Look up YouTube on how to make a yes. candle. Pour that stuff in here, a bunch of wax, a bunch of essential oils and all that good stuff. Fill it up, put your wick in there, do whatever they say, you have a candle. The other half, you have a really cool, if I had a light bulb, I would show you, but I do not. Okay. Okay, you can hire an electrician or just <laughs> look up YouTube on how to like put wires together. You could fill, like at Home Depot, they sell these little you know, light bulb thingies which yes. well gosh darn it i left it in the house uh you put it in there you have a light bulb in here you have the wire hanging out from the cord you mm -hmm. plug that in or you hardwired into like you know where like a fan would be oh, oh, you know and like then it would be like it'd be a, like a light so you could do like three of these have them all hanging a lampshade or not a lampshade like, like, like uh gosh like over your yeah. island yeah you know just like a really accent light you know you could do that with these so it's a lot of fun oh. and Jaden yeah. grego asks what's your favorite movie I'm sure he's asking you. Oh. Well, I mean, mine, I have no idea. What is yours? I don't we'll, know. we'll just start there. I, I don't know. What's your favorite There's movie? There's so many good ones. Okay, so I know me and Izzy's favorite movie. As soon as I say it, she's going to say, oh, duh, is The Greatest Showman. Oh, like, yeah, seriously? Yeah, 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 exactly. Yeah. The Greatest Showman. If you guys haven't watched yes. that yet, it's like. A, I'm pretty sure it's still in theater. Yeah, it, yeah. It, we've saw it three, four, four, four times. Yeah. Think three, Too many four. times, but oh my gosh, it is really the greatest show. Like, you're going to, like, totally, like, it's awesome. So good, so good. Um, so yeah. Yes. So, but that's uh, hmm. I could make a smaller bottle out of it. You, you, you could. We have a small, yes, a smaller bottle out of it. Yes. Oh, cause you do glass, Jaden. I think that's the glass person, right? If you're the glass person, you could probably weld it back with your glass welding skills and yes. totally make it totally rock. Now, the last part of our show, my favorite part of the show. Uh, is I know what you're saying is hey, how did you get all that sticky residue off the glass? Well, here's a tip So when you're trying to get glass or uh, glass any kind of thing they have yes. gooby gone They have all this stuff you have to pay money for yeah. But if you're like me, you always have a can of WD. <laughs> like me, WD, not sponsored. Uh, you spray, which I think this can doesn't really have anything left in it. Uh, <laughs> you spray some WD-40 onto the sticky residue of anything of your choice. You rub it off mm -hmm. and it comes out like amazing. WD-40 is seriously a miracle in a can. That's what they should have called. It should just be miracle in a can 30. It's too long though. Yeah. It's too long. Well, we seriously hope you guys had a fun time. Yes. We know we did. And if you didn't, well, you probably should watch it again. Watch our other videos. And watch, watch our watch other watch videos. There's some videos. funny ones in there somewhere. Gosh, she is just a ball of <laughs> hilariousness. Oh, goodness. All right. Can you tell us that joke again? No, no, I'm kidding. No. All right, so thank you guys for uh, tuning in. We really appreciate it. Uh, oh, and Nate Nagel plays twenty one said you should make a play button out of glass, but hmm. you don't know how to like work with glass that good. So Shh, do you? don't tell him that. Oh, I'll learn. He, he's great at it. <laughs> I've made three. <laughs> well, thank you guys. Okay. We will see you next time. Uh, uh, <laughs> well, hey, and it didn't even break. It didn't even it didn't break. Break. It's okay. Have a good night, guys. Bye. See you later. Tell Dan TDM we want to make him a play button. Shit.